10 Universities Where Super Rich Kids Go Rich kids will always want to attend universities that satisfy their standards. They're very critical when it comes to their institution of choice, considering various factors. Basically, the rich will always search for the best, no matter how expensive it costs, simply because they can afford it. Here are some of the universities where super rich kids go. 1. American University in Dubai the American University in Dubai is a private academically and ethnically inclusive institution of higher learning, providing a globally recognized American education. The university is accredited regionally by the UAE Ministry of Education, as well as the Southern Association of Colleges and Schools in the US. Rank third is the world's most diverse university. AUD offers both UAE and international students an American-style education in one of the most lively and important cities in the world. Dubai is a country of considerable wealth, owing to its oil-rich natural resources. Therefore, it doesn't come as a surprise that some of the local colleges are filled with super-rich kids. American University in Dubai is one of them, and it's known famously for having a parking lot packed with a lot of luxury cars. Among the cars you'll probably see on your way to class are Porsches, Aston Martins, Ferraris, Range Rovers, and McLarens, all belonging to students in their early 20s. A student once commented that the cars Dubai students drive are just ludicrous. 2. University of London The University of London is a federal research university in London, England. The university has 17 member institutions and three central academic bodies as of March 2020. It has 178,735 campus-based internal students and 48,000 distance learning external students, making it the largest university by number of students in the UK. Its most famous school is the highly competitive School of Economics, which has produced the likes of billionaire investor George Soros. More than 50% of LSE undergraduate students don't take out a loan, and roughly 45% of them are foreign students, who are mostly rich by the way. It turns out that about 7.5% of all UK-based millionaires attended the University of London. Three. Stanford University Stanford University, officially Leland Stanford Junior University, is a private research university located in Stanford, California. When it comes to major education publications, Stanford is ranked among the top five in the world. The university faculty and alumni have founded many successful companies, such as Google, Hewlett Packard, PayPal, Nike, Yahoo, and many others. Forbes went ahead and stated that it's almost impossible to name a leading edge company in Silicon Valley that isn't closely associated with Stanford. Many of the university's students living in California come from wealthy families, with undergraduate fees set at around $60,000 annually. The main reason why the university is full of rich kids is probably because of its legacy admission policy. It was mentioned in one of their alumni magazines that the percentage of alumni children admitted to Stanford is estimated at three times the overall percentage of acceptance. So basically, if you're an alumni and donate occasionally to the university, there's a really high chance that your child will get in as well. 4. Oxford University The university has an international reputation for its world-leading research, teaching, and resources, together with a beautiful and historic city. It's buzzing with activity, drawing students from all over the world. The university is acclaimed for being one of the universities that continually educates millionaires based in the UK. It's the longest-running university in the English-speaking countries, and some of its alumni include renowned scholars, scientists, businessmen, and more. The head of the undergraduate admissions told the UK Telegraph newspaper in 2013 that the university selects its students on nothing but merit, and they don't simply want an institution full of thick rich kids. In spite of their efforts to not enroll students based on how rich they are, a large portion of the attending students are really wealthy. In 2013, for example, a super-rich man of Arab descent advertised for a private tutor to help him secure a place in the university, offering a salary of more than $200,000. 5. University of Mumbai The University of Mumbai, once called University of Bombay, is one of the first modern universities established by the British in 1857. Originally an affiliating and degree-granting institution, the university added teaching to its functions later on. The university has faculties of arts, science, technology, law, medicine, commerce, and many more. It has more than 250,000 enrolled students. According to the Times of India, the prestigious university also has more multimillionaires as alumni than Brown or Cambridge. What's interesting is that the university isn't for those who want to be millionaires, because most of the students already inherited their wealth and their status as multimillionaires. Regardless, it's thought of as an incubator for rich Indians, having educated a lot of super-rich kids from super-rich families. 6. 
University of Pennsylvania University of Pennsylvania is a private college, founded in 1740, and the campus rests on 209 acres of land. Nearly 280 years after Benjamin broke new ground in founding the institution, this Ivy League college's students, alumni, and faculty continue to be trailblazers in leadership and excellence. It's top choice for students who want high academics and a robust social life. The very first collegiate business school in the world was the Wharton School and is one of the largest of Penn's four undergraduate schools, the others being the College of Arts and Sciences, the School of Engineering and Applied Science, and the School of Nursing. The university reels in its fair share of super-rich kids year in and year out. A study conducted among the students of Penn revealed that nearly 30% had parents who earned $250,000 or more and that about 65% of all freshmen came from middle to upper class backgrounds. President Trump also attended the university himself and enrolled two of his kids as well. Other rich and famous people to send their kids there are Denzel Washington and Joan Rivers, the comedian. It costs roughly $60,000 to attend the school every year as an undergrad, but the outcome is good once you graduate. A certain study showed that about 1,500 University of Pennsylvania graduates are worth over $240 billion when put together. 7. Brown University Brown University in Providence, Rhode Island is considered to be among the most liberal and unconventional schools in the Northeast. The college has an open curriculum, where students have the freedom to create their own program and explore the more than 80 academic concentrations before making up their mind on one or two fields. The university meets 100% of students demonstrating financial needs with no loans only scholarship grants through the Brown Promise. When it comes to wealthy celebs in their preferred college, many will immediately call Brown University to mind. Some of the outstanding Brown alumni include John F. Kennedy Jr., CNN founder Ted Turner, actors Emma Watson and John Krasinski, Jack Nicholson, John Kenny's daughters, and many other wealthy Americans. Based in Rhode Island, the university has consistently been ranked as one of the richest colleges in the states, based on the number of students who are in need of financial aid. 8. Yale University Yale University is a private Ivy League research university in New Haven, Connecticut. Founded in 1701 as the Collegiate School, it's the third oldest institution of higher learning in the U.S. and one of the colonial colleges chartered before the American Revolution. It was renamed Yale College in 1718 to honor the school's largest benefactor, Elihu Yale. It stands out for its residential college system, elite academics, and consistent production of American leaders. Research is a major point of emphasis at the college, with more than 800 science, math, and labs at the university, and 95% of undergraduate science majors taking part in faculty-led research. In 2014, it was observed that among the freshmen of that year, 69% were from rich families, earning $120,000 or more a year. Less than 10% of Yale students receive Pell Grants. As a result of these shocking figures, Yale's alumni magazine announced in the same year that the university was on the lookout for smart students from poor families, most likely in an attempt to balance things up. They later issued an apology after receiving a lot of criticism for the cover article. The head of nearly every industry is populated by Yale graduates. Among the former Yaleys include five former U.S. presidents and 20 Nobel laureates. Other notable alumni include the founders of Boeing, FedEx, Blackstone Group, Pinterest, actor Claire Danes, and Levi Jackson. 9. Columbia University This Ivy League university is among the oldest and most reputable research universities in the U.S. Columbia's academic cornerstone and also a focus for debate is its core curriculum. All undergraduates are required to pick a set of common courses from literature and humanities to sciences. The university offers both need-blind and need-based financial assistance in the form of grants and students' work loans. Roughly 84 people who have either taught, studied at Columbia, or conducted research have won the Nobel Peace Prize. The university has produced notable alumni, such as former President Barack Obama, billionaire Robert Kraft, Maggie Gyllenhaal, and director Catherine Bigelow, and Alicia Keys. When it comes to the top 1% of society, Columbia and New York is where you'll likely find them. Known among college students as being full of wealthy and smart kids, the university has a low admission rate, and almost all its students would have scored 20, 50 or more. Aside from attaining impressive grades, one also needs to chuck $64,000 or more each academic year as an undergrad. 10. Harvard University The first institution of higher learning to be established in the United States, Harvard University is often regarded as the gold standard for higher education. With nearly four centuries of academic excellence under its belt, Harvard undergraduates can select from 50 concentrations, take part in world-class research opportunities, or take advantage of the largest academic library globally. With the largest academic endorsement across the globe, valued at close to $40 billion, the university offers several financial aid options for enrolled students. The institution's admission policy ensures all admitted students will have enough funds for a Harvard education. 
The Harvard College Financial Aid Program doesn't require contributions from families with incomes below $65,000. Despite all this, research shows that a majority of the population are rich students. Nearly 45% of its undergraduates come from families earning $200,000 or more every year. That's up there with the top few percent of all Americans. In late 2013, the New York Times reported that there's a second society of ultra-wealthy students who go on weekend-long party vacations in countries like Iceland, Russia, and more. MBA graduate Christine Wallace told the New York Times that class was a much bigger divide compared to gender at the university and that she would have to spend thousands of dollars to be fully involved socially. Adding to that, Harvard is a hotspot for those who want to be multimillionaires someday. To date, more than 3,000 of its graduates are worth $200 million or more, many of them having a head start from their super rich parents. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Comment down below your thoughts and suggestions, and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed the content. Also, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. With that said, have a great day you guys, and I'll see you in the next one.